food samples. Rosie went to the supermarket. She wanted to buy milk, cereal, and chicken. She took a shopping cart. She went to the meat aisle. She grabbed a pack of chicken and put it inside the shopping cart. She went to the dairy aisle. She grabbed a gallon of milk and put it inside the shopping cart. She went to the cereal aisle. She grabbed a box of sweet cereal and put it inside the shopping cart. She saw a long line of people. She was curious what they were lining up for. She looked at the front of the line. They were giving out samples of pizza. Samples are free. There is always a line for samples. Rosie decided to stand in line, too. Fried cabbage. Gina recently moved out of her parents' place. She was excited and scared. She lived with her parents for over 18 years. Her parents used to cook for her. Now she must cook for herself. At first, she went out to eat a lot. But it got too expensive. She decided to learn how to cook. She planned to make fried cabbage. It was healthy and easy to make. She put a pan on the stove. She turned on the stove. She put some oil on the pan. She put the cabbage in the pan. She stirred the cabbage around. She closed the pan with a lid. She waited a couple minutes. It was ready. Working at the library. Alan works at the library. He is a librarian. His job is to help people check out books. He also helps them find books. He loves working with people. His favorite job is talking to people about books. Every week he holds a book club. He also helps shelf and organize the books. Alan's favorite types of books are fantasy books. He loves sharing his views on books with others. The library is like his second home. He hopes that people enjoy their time as much as he does. Books are his escape from his problems. The library is open to everyone. He likes working with all types of people. A generous woman. She had a lot of money. She was a generous woman. She was once poor. She understood what it was like. She wanted to help out. On Christmas Day, she handed out food to the poor. She made the food herself. She put a turkey leg, a scoop of mashed potatoes, and peas on a plate. She gave the plate to each homeless person she saw. The homeless people loved her. One homeless man even gave her a penny. She said to keep it for himself. She decided to do more. She gave fifty dollars to every homeless person she saw. She felt good. Borrowing books and movies. Kaylin went to the library. She needed to get books for her project on Barack Obama. She found his biography. It was a heavy book with a lot of information. She flipped through the pages. There were some nice pictures of Obama. The book seemed helpful. She put it in her basket. She found the movie section. She decided to check it out. She could borrow a movie for three days for free. It would cost three dollars to borrow a movie for seven days. She picked a movie about a girl with diabetes. She put it in her basket. She checked out the book and the movie.